My name is Saliwe Mtetwa. I am the founder and director of an organization called Talia Women's Network based in Harare, Zimbabwe. So Talia exists to empower and equip young women and girls um, with, with the necessary skills that they need so that they pursue opportunities in terms of um, education, um, their health, as well as um, economic empowerment in life. I'm currently the Senior Programs Officer and the Team Lead for Gender and Advocacy at my organization called International Needs Ghana. At International Needs Ghana, we mainly work with children and women. So even in the weeks that I've been back, we have been reaching out to women in rural communities with business management and financial literacy skills. Um, and uh, we also help them to be able to establish income generating projects so that they improve their quality of life. So this is one of the things that we've, we've continued um, doing. Um, I have been in the trenches in the rural communities training women and to date for this year our target for this year we have 356 women who are currently going through this training program but this award has just given me that drive motivation it's given me inspiration and it's given me the confidence to just keep going on and going on and going on especially when it comes to dealing with girls and women empowerment feminist approaches feminism in our society you know people just think feminists are radical they're just there to uh, to to be abrasive and to resist everything so it's just it has also been just trying to make them understand that we are standing for the disadvantaged first thing i did was to have a session with them on women empowerment letting them know that they have rights they have choices and they have opportunities I've also engaged adolescent girls and I think uh, I've engaged almost 800 adolescent girls since I came back. For me, it's been very busy. It's been like, super exciting and it's been impactful. I can see that I have grown within the seven weeks that I've been at Kodi. So in our language, uh, thank you, we say mwashu matinobonga. And um, that's exactly what I would want to articulate today, that I am tr truly grateful, firstly, to Kodi for giving me the opportunity to participate on, on the Global Change Leaders Program. I have already started making adjustments to some of the content that we are using to engage girls, because these girls grow up to become women. You know, and so if they grow up, they, they still have these social norms and beliefs in, in their minds and in their lives, then they grow up to become those same women who don't believe that they could be anything or achieve anything. So I believe that getting the girls from a very young age to understand their issues is really important. And it's all dependent on the content we are feeding them with. So one of the first things I have done is to, is to review some of the content that I work with. And I know that in the long term, it's going to have uh, very positive impact on the group of girls that we are working with. Receiving the Catherine Fleming International Development Award has really boosted my confidence and it's really driving my performance. To the, um, the Catherine Fleming Award Committee for selecting us for this, it's, it was such an honor. And uh, just to assure them that, you know, if you just keep checking on us as an organization and um, and also just following the work that we do. We'll also try to communicate as much as we can so that you see the value that you are bringing just because we are standing on the shoulders of a giant, Catherine Fleming, and we won't let this this award just go to waste. We are going to, you know, to put it to full use. Catherine may be gone physically, but she still lives with us. And even having this award just makes me feel like she lives within all of us. Keep supporting women so that we can drive change in the world. Thank you.